So welcome to Science Time. Today we're going to learn about what makes night and day. So we've got this ball, which is the shape of the earth. <clears throat> and if you look on the ball right there, there's Canada and Calgary where, where we are. And we also have Cece here, Nathan, and Lil. So, the earth sits in space like this. It's actually turned a little bit to the side, but we're not going to worry about that now because we're just talking about night and day. Some other time we'll learn about the tilt of the earth, which is actually what causes the seasons. So, for right now, we've got the sun over here being played by Nathan. Nathan's holding the flashlight. And it's dark in space, but the sun is what? What is the sun, Cece? It's light. The sun provides light, but what's it made out of? Fire. Yeah, so there's lots of fire, and it lights up lots of things. So when the, the flashlight's on, then that'll be when it's sunshine. Okay, so Cece's going to go turn the light off, because there's only dark in space if there's no sun or stars. I'm just turning I'm just yeah. turn the so. light if you look here, with Nathan shining the sun on us, <clears throat> it's daytime in Calgary where we are. So Cece's, no, the sun doesn't move. The sun doesn't move. So Cece's going to turn it. Turn it, no, the other way. Yeah, Cece's turning it, and we'll see right now. Look, it's daytime, daytime in India. Keep going. It's daytime in Africa. And look, it's starting to be sunrise. Now it's daytime in Canada again. See right there, daytime in Canada. But over here, on the other side, it's dark in China and India. So that's how day and night work demonstrated with a ball and a flashlight. And that was science time. We'll talk to you again later. Say bye. 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 Say bye.